You can dance, you can jive. Oh my god, there was a bee. <laughs> Up. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Rebecca and you should totally subscribe. Alright, good morning. So today is going to be a super fun day because let's take a look at my Pinterest for a second. So basically, that is going to be what controls my entire morning today. I thought it would be super fun to just kind of let my Pinterest decide everything for me this morning. So my breakfast, my outfit, my hair, literally everything that I would do in the morning. But before we get started, make sure to give this video a thumbs up down below. You can subscribe, turn on the bell notification button so that you get notified every time I upload a brand new video. Also, you can follow me on Pinterest. My username is Rebecca underscore Grace 04. And yeah, with that said, let's get started with this video. All right, so the first step of the day is coffee and breakfast. So for breakfast, I'm gonna go to my food slash drinks board. And then I actually have a section in here called breakfast. So I'm gonna go into that. And let's see, what do I wanna make today? Ooh, something like this may be cool. I've been wanting to try something like this for a while, where it's like a bagel with cream cheese and tomato and avocado. I'm pretty sure we have tomatoes, but if we don't, I'll make something else. So I think I'm gonna try this. And then now I need to figure out coffee. So also in this board, I have a section called coffee. So I don't have that much to work with for this, but I was thinking something like, oh yeah, something like this, where I kind of put like the foam on top. All right, now we're gonna go downstairs to make some food. Okay, so I just went and collected all of my ingredients. So I have my bagel here that I'm going to put in the toaster. I don't have an everything bagel, but I do have everything bagel seasoning, which I will put inside. And that looks like this. We don't have Trader Joe's here in Canada. So I got this from Superstore, I think. And it's huge and it's really good. So yeah. And then I have my cream cheese and then half of an avocado because I used the other half yesterday. And then a tomato. All right, so let's go ahead and attempt to make this fun little breakfast sandwich thing. Okay, so the avocado did not turn out that well because this avocado was not good for some reason, but we're just doing the best we can here. So now I'm going to put the cream cheese on my bagel. Okay, so I'm pretty sure that the person in this photo put it on the top and the bottom, yeah, okay. Okay, now I have to put the everything bagel seasoning on both sides because this is not an everything bagel, but we're gonna make it an everything bagel. This is gonna be very messy. All right, so this is the finished product. So obviously it does not look as good as the one in the photo, but I think it still turned out better than I thought it would. And I'm definitely gonna take a picture of it and everything like that. And I'll let you know how it is when I try it, obviously. But now we need to make the coffee. Take my hand and hold it tight. Look at the paintings, I'll be your guide Don't stop looking in my eyes Are you cold? Do you want to sit down? Oh my gosh, okay, so I put that right to the brim Okay, so I just put everything back upstairs and I'm going to eat it in a second, but first I obviously have to take pictures of it. So I just kind of have these both laid out right here and I'm gonna take some pictures and I will insert them in this video. All right, are we ready for the taste test? Here we go, here we go, okay. That is actually really good. The cream cheese definitely helps. I actually really like it. I was right though, it is very messy. <laughs> Okay, so the next step of the day is to get dressed, do my hair, makeup, everything like that. So to pick up my outfit, I'm gonna go on to my fashion board. So here I have like sections separated from like t-shirts, shirts, sweater shorts, and everything like that, like just so I can separate those basic items. But then in the actual board is where I have like all the outfits. So it is pretty hot today again, so I think I wanna do some kind of like t-shirt and shorts kind of situation. 
Hmm, okay, so maybe actually something like this would be cool. The shirt that this girl is wearing actually reminds me of this gray, like, Star Wars graphic tee that I have. So I could kind of do, like, an oversized t-shirt situation with, like, bike shorts or something, maybe? Or just any kind of, like, more comfy, soft shorts. So I think I'm gonna do something like that. And then now what I want to do is kind of pick out some accessories. So I also have a board called accessories. And in here, it is separated into sections of, like, the different types of accessories. Earrings, I don't have that many earring options. I only have my first holes done. So I think I'm gonna wear just like my um, bigger silver hoops and then as for necklaces I always have this one on right here. This like little silver key one, but actually yeah right here Like I've seen a lot of photos where like people will stack necklaces and I think that that always looks really cool So I might want to pick out like another necklace to kind of go with this one And then also I think I want to wear some rings I kind of like something like this where like you have like one ring on one finger But then on the other one it's like stacked so where you stack rings I might want to do something like that as well. So I think that that's going to be the plan for my outfit today. So I'm going to go ahead and find all of these items. Okay, so I think I found everything and I have it all laid out right here. So this is the Star Wars shirt that I was talking about. It's a little bit oversized. I'm pretty sure it's a men's shirt. And then I have like two shorts options. I have these black biker shorts and then these black like more just like flowy shorts. And then I have my jewelry. So I have the necklace that I have on right now. And then I also found this necklace. And this one's kind of more of like a rose gold color. And it's this really pretty like star mood necklace thing. And then these are the earrings that I was talking about. These silver mini hoops. And then I also have my rings right here. So this one I actually got for Christmas last year so I'm gonna wear this one and then I also have these three mini rose gold ones to go along with the rose gold necklace so I'll probably stack a few of these and yeah so this is what we're working with today I'm gonna go put all this on and show you when I'm done okay so here's the outfit this is what the shirt looks like and then I tucked it in a little bit here at the front and then I ended up going with these shorts and then I have on the necklaces so I have this one as like the lower one and then my key one as the one above it and then this is what the earrings look like and then this is what the rings look like so I put this one on this finger here and then I stacked these two in the middle and then I have this one on this hand so yeah this is the fit for today the Pinterest outfit it's nothing too special because I want it to be comfy and I'm staying at home today so I didn't really want to be too uncomfortable Okay, so now that I'm done my outfit, it is time to figure out what I want to do with my makeup. So for this, I'm going to go on to my board that is called Beauty Slash Self Care. And I actually have a section in here called Makeup Looks. And I'm thinking that I don't want to do something too crazy today. And I feel like I also see a lot of like stuff like this, where it's like super subtle, super like natural looking, kind of. Where it's like the simple like eyeshadow wing. So I think I'm going to do something like this for today. So before I do the actual like eye part of the makeup, I'm going to do my eyebrows. So to do my eyebrows, I use the Benefit Gimme Brow Brow Tint thing. It looks like this, and it's a super easy way to do your eyebrows because it's literally like mascara, but for your eyebrows. So this is the first thing that I'm going to do. Okay, so this is what my brows look like after I do them. So now it is time to do some eyeliner before I do mascara. So if you haven't seen my easy natural makeup look thing video, then basically the way that I like to do my eyeshadow eyeliner is I like to use tape. Basically, I'll just like grab a small piece and then put it like on my eyes so that it's easier to do a wing. So I'll kind of put it like that and it's actually really uncomfortable. So I try to go like as fast as possible and I'm just going to go in with like a dark brown color. And then I'll just peel the tape off and then I have a really subtle natural wing. Wait, it actually looks really bad today. Shoot. No. Oh my gosh. Okay, and then there's the other eye. I got some on my eyelid though, so I have to go get that off. Okay, so now that I'm done the eyeliner, I'm going to do mascara. So I use the uh, Maybelline Great Lash Mascara. This was like the first mascara that I ever used, and I basically have only ever really used this mascara. I really, really like it, and it is definitely my favorite. And there we go. Okay, that actually doesn't look that bad. It's like super simple. So yeah, this is the finished makeup look, and now it's time for hair. Okay, so now it's time for hair. So this is actually probably one of the most exciting parts for me. I always find that like doing my hair just kind of brings the look all together. So for this, I'm going to go into my board that's called hair. And this is probably one of my favorite boards because it's super helpful. I have like all these sections with different types of hairstyles. So I think today I'm feeling like an easy half up, half down kind of situation. So I really like all of these. I'm actually thinking that I want to do kind of like a half up, half down, but with a claw clip. Because I always see hairstyles with claw clips like all over Pinterest. 
list. So I think I'm gonna do something like this, but with a claw clip. Okay, so this is the claw clip that I have, and it's just like one of these like brownish colored ones. So I'm just gonna take, wait, I need a mirror. All right, so I'm gonna take like half of my hair. I don't wanna like perfectly pull it back. I want it so you can still see my part a little bit. Let's do like a big one. Let's go like right above my ears. Pull it back like that to start. And then I'm gonna take my clip and attempt to grab all the hair back here and pull it back. I think I let some go on this side, yeah. Actually, that's not too bad. Pull some pieces out. I might have to redo it. I wanna like pull two pieces down from up here too. Ooh, okay. Oh. Oh, this hair is deciding to just kind of do its own thing right now. I think I'm going to keep this. I'm just going to curl these two pieces at the front so that they kind of lie a bit better. And then I'm also going to kind of use a bobby pin to just pin up this side right over here. But otherwise, that was not too bad for a first try. So I'm going to go get some bobby pins. Okay, so this is the finished hair, I think think these pieces at the front are a little weird today but this is basically what the hair looks like so this is basically the completed look for today so the second last step of my morning is to take some instagram photos in this epic outfit and then also come up with a caption so i actually have a board on my pinterest called photo shoot ideas and basically in here i have like sections for photo shoots in like every different type of situation so i have like city slash town photos park photos road photos beach photos everything like that but the one that I'm going to be using today is the bedroom slash indoor photos. So I don't have that many pins in this section quite yet, but I actually really do like this most recent pin that I did. And it's basically this photo of like this girl on like her bed and her hair looks really cool and everything like that. So I might try to do a photo similar to this. And then I also have a section in this board called poses slash other. So this board is basically just for like pose ideas and everything. So I think I'm going to take some photos and I'll end up posting them on Instagram and everything like that so that you guys can see them. And I'll probably also show them in this video okay so I have my phone propped up right here against this blanket kind of like in the corner of my bed and I'm gonna attempt to take some cool photos right now so let's see how this turns out Ryan Little. <laughs> We're videoing. <laughs> okay, so I just finished taking some photos, and by some photos, I mean a lot of photos. Like, I always take so many photos, and then I have such a hard time deciding which ones I actually want to post. So I'm going to go through these, edit them, everything like that. So you guys will see those on my Instagram, at least by the time this video is up. But I'm actually going to do that a little later. First, I want to find a nice caption for these photos. So usually for captions, I will think of one. Or if I can't think of one, I will go into my board called Inspiration. And here's where I always pin like a whole bunch of different quotes. So I want something, I don't know, just like fun, you know, for this photo, for this post. See, like maybe something like this would be nice, just where I say like, worry less and do your best. Sometimes I just have to like decide with the first one that I see or else I will take ages choosing one. So I think I'm gonna go with this one for this post. All right, so that was basically like my last step of the morning. So that completes my Pinterest controls my morning video. This was a super fun video to make. I definitely plan on making more videos like this in the future. So make sure you subscribe to stay tuned for those. Once again, you can follow me on Pinterest. My username is Rebecca underscore Grace 04. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up down below. Subscribe, turn on the bell notification button. I upload every single Thursday at 11 a.m. Eastern time. So I will see you guys back here next week for a brand new video. Bye. Thank you.